हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल टाटा टाटा आर्ट क्लब एंड हंड्रेड डेज ऑफ स्केचिंग यस दिस इज विजय हियर एंड ऑन दिस चैनल आई डू शेयर लॉर्ड ऑफ टिप्स अबाउट द ड्राइंग एंड स्केचिंग रेगुलरली Yes, guys. I'm very, I'm very excited today. Is the my favorite one of the my favorite topic sketching. I'm gonna start today is the superheroes. Yes, today is the nineteenth day of my sketching challenge, and from now onward, like next four to five days, I'm just gonna do the sketching on a various superheroes. And guess which is the superhero for today? So to know, please stay tuned with this video till the end. Yes, guys, welcome back. In today's day, we're gonna do the sketching on the superhero, a Batman. Yes, is the DC Comics one of the favorite and most popular character is the a Batman. i uh, personally like um, superheroes because it has a lot of lot of energy in their poses in their character there are a lot of muscles and a strong feeling which like always i inspired me to do a lot of more than most sketching even as i like i belong to the animation uh, industry so that is also one of the reason i love to do this sketching So let's go to the board and see what references I have. Yes, so this is the strong pose, the standing pose, which has a lot of power or the confidence. You can see here, and that is what we're gonna uh, try to capture today in this uh, sketching. And more, uh, I can see that the uh, the muscles, the anatomy. you will get to learn lot of things on these things while you do the sketching it's important to first of all go step by step is like as i shown in the previous videos you just start from the a line of action then the the basic structures basic forms a uh, solid forms you can draw for the each and every body part and then you can go building the uh, more and more stuff like muscles and clothing and the gadgets what the character has so if you capture the right line of action then yes you are done with most of the your work so let's start here now so as i start with the upper body which is the a chest part so it is little like tilted and somewhat this is the basic thing so body line of action is somewhat so head is little tilted toward the right side and yeah is quite broad the chest is and yes the everything what you can see in this is like more extra 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 then the uh, regular person or regular thing so you can see this the curvature the muscles and the the fist is in a one rhythm one of the line complete line of action is there So 
so i'm just doing the uh, basic skeleton So I am pretty much happy with the the skeleton, the pose, and this thing. So basic forms is give you the uh, the dimension, and one more thing is that are you following the right perspective? Everything is to be in a as per the eye level and all. So all those things you have to keep seeing into that. So this way it's the head is little tilted So the nose and a very typical identically the uh, lips So after that there is the scape is here which is folding and coming in front of this and joining here. quite broad shoulder if you compare this head comparatively this shoulder is quite long so if you have a basic anatomy study properly so this will help you to follow this some of the structure i'm not go going too much in the muscles and all but the overall gesture and line of action i'm try to capture here
yes then there is the uh, a belt you can see here now we will come to the hand so hand is the uh, basic cylindrical form is this and the other side also So that firm fist you can see here yes so you can add some of the dimensions or the muscles to shoulders and on the muscle itself there is a covering same way with the other side and here also the same the covering
the lower body portion is the hip portion this is generally it is and uh, the legs this is the cylindrical form of legs So now on these legs also there is a lot of different different muscles you can see here. And close to the knees again there is a sort of mechanical joint and covering for the leg
Yes, so that is what the uh, body structure and all we almost done with it. And the most important part is the a uh, cape. So without the cape, how Batman will be complete? And that is very interesting part which they give the lot of force and the uh, plus line of action. So it plays also one of the major role in giving more action drama to the entire thing. So yes, that is the uh, sketch is ready. I'll, today I'll just, instead of using pencil only, I'll be using a pen and making a sketch more interesting and clear. So before that, I'll just erase some of the lines or lighten the all the lines.
this is the main identity of batman is the logo on the chest
Sasu the sketch and some of the part identity which I'll just make a darker. I purposely here just following the angle of this keep direction it will give more force yes so yes guys this is what this sketch for today is the we done a superhero batman with the proper gestures and the a study of a basic forms and plus the uh, how you can put a lot of force into it with the uh, some of the shading parts so i hope you like this if you like please comment it share it and like it if you have any queries about this today session please write it in the comment box and i'll try to get back to you as soon as possible so this is for today and we'll meet tomorrow with the another superhero i was a little surprised so till the time you can guess what it is and we can meet tomorrow till the time just keep practicing keep sketching and keep smiling